color you're going to want to take is a yellow color and I'm using from Heavily Naturals Logic. That's it. Okay? These eyeshadows are very, very pigmented. So a little goes a long way. Well, I'm going to take that color and I am going to put it in the inner part of my eye. So like right above the tear duct. And then just kind of put it one third of the way. Now we're going to take a green color. This is Panic. And you're going to take that. And you're going to put that in the center of your eyelid. Now the thing about the rainbow looks is you have to blend. So this green and this yellow, you have to blend it. When you blend those two together, you're going to get like a light green color, like a lime green color. So you have to make sure that with every color that you put beside each other that you're blending them in. The next color I'm going to take is Pixie, this blue color. And this one, you're going to put on the... Uh, outer part of your eye. And remember, blend it in. You gotta blend it in. If you don't blend it in, this is gonna look totally wrong. Now you need a white eyeshadow, and I'm gonna use Pure from Pure Luxe, and you're gonna put that as your highlighter colors. You want it white so that it looks like a cloud, basically. Okay, now you need a baby blue color, and from the Coastal Sense palette, I think I'm going to go with the middle row, the top shadow. You need a baby blue color, and then what you do is um, right below the bow bone, you start blending it, and just bring it down into the crease. And now you just need like a true blue kind of color, and I'm going to use um, from, these things are, you get them from like Scandalous or from Still Glamorous, but this, it's called Bright Blue, it's a paint, and um, you take that and you blend that right into the crease, right into it. Okay, and since you really have to make sure all of these blend well together so it really kind of looks like a rainbow, at the outer part I'm going to have to make it a little deeper so I can blend out this these two blues. So from the Coastal Sense palette, I'm going to use the bottom color, and this is like a bluish purple. It's kind of like indigo except more purple leaked, okay? You're just going to take that color and you put it on the outer part of your lid and you just blend that in and really just stay really toward the outer part of your lid. Take that same color and right at the outer part of your crease, like right, right in the crease. Just kind of blend it in. Bringing it upward like this, instead of like doing this, helps it more to blend in. Now you need to take an orange color and I'm using Danger from um, Heavily Naturals, of course. And you're going to take that color and you put that at the lower part of this here duck. So right here. Next color you're going to need is like a red color and this is called Sacrifice. It's like a deeper red than this one. It's like a reddish garnet. You're going to take a little bit of that. You don't only need a lot. And on the lower lash line right by the orange right here, place it. But you don't need a lot. Like I said, you don't need a lot. You need a pink color. And this is called, um, what is Dow Face? And you're going to take the pink one. And about that much. So you got orange, red, and now the pink color. And then last but not least, you need purple. And this one's called Diva. It reminds me if Barney was grinded into an eyeshadow. And you put that on the outer part of your lid. Oh, I love this one. Now just take an eyeliner brush, this is from Coastal Suns, and wet it, and then dip it into the Diva color, which is the purple color, and then put that in your waterline. Okay, now line your um, lash line with a black liquid liner and mascara. Fake eyelashes if you want, and I'm going to use the Red Cherry. They're number 106, but it's two of them layered onto each other. So I'm going to put those on and be back. Mm -hmm. 